today I'm shooting locally again and I've come out in search of some fungi. So I took some shots just a bit further up where I did that first piece to camera but I've just come across these, these mushrooms just here. They're beautiful and I'm using this log to kind of guide you in a little bit like that. I'll talk you through my settings very quickly. I'm quite happy with the shot, I've already taken it. I am shooting a 40th of a second F5 and ISO 400 because it's actually quite dark down here. There's a few patches of sunshine coming through and the cloud is starting to break up after sort of a very cloudy morning but hopefully those settings will look quite good and I'm quite happy with that shot so I'll pop it up now for you. I hope you enjoyed those shots. I've just moved a little bit off the beaten track here and I've come across, let me show you, this is really actually quite interesting. These, these sort of intertwined fallen branches, it might actually be more of a tree. I think that's all connected coming through there. But it looks quite mysterious. From this angle, I'm not sure, you probably don't get it, but from down here, there's, there's, a, there's some orange in the background over there and it's just it's quite a nice it's quite a nice little image um, a bit of chaos in the foreground and then in the background there's this beautiful orange color I've just had another idea there's a, a leaf that just fell on the branches but then it fell away so I'm thinking if I can pop that on there it might make it a little bit more autumnal so I'll give that a go and I'll pop up another shot but this little area here is beautiful it's away from people people clearly do come down here because there's like little lean-to's been made by kids and stuff but it's it's just a nice little area just to find some intimate little shots I don't think I was thinking I might be able to get a, a wider shot but it's all quite spaced out I'd want it all a little bit more compact if you know what I mean but there's definitely opportunity here and actually I've just spotted a few more mushrooms over that way so I'll have a little bit of an explore around here and I'll pop up, pop up any shots that I've got for you now. So I've just moved through the park a little bit more and I'm, I'm trying to find and trying to inspire myself with autumn. Autumn is definitely one of my favourite seasons. I'm a big fan of winter, but I do love the colours of autumn. I think most photographers do. And I'm just kind of finding everything that starts to sum up the early signs of autumn, really. Conkers falling out of trees. I've got some beautiful, more stock imagery shots of a conker on sort of the multi-coloured orangey brown carpet of the woodland floor and then of course I've got the, the fungus shots and then I've got the the leaves which are still clinging onto the trees at the moment but I'm just I'm just enjoying the shooting of it that's kind of why I'm not picking up the video camera so much to talk to you guys because it's just I needed some inspiration and I'm finding it and it's right on my doorstep which is lovely so I will carry on with my little meander through the park woodland. Yeah, let's see what else I can find. <laughs> 